Hey, Dr. Alavito, how are you doing today? I'm doing well. How are you doing, Bailey? I'm doing great, thank you. Great. Are you ready to answer these 21 questions? Let's go. Today we are here at Brunswick Middle School, a school you were once an assistant principal at. What did you enjoy about being an assistant principal? As an assistant principal, it was really my first opportunity to lead the full school experience. I loved engaging with staff and supporting students and really celebrating them. You are the Executive Director of System Accountability and School Administration in your current role. What exactly do you do? I oversee, in a nutshell, our 70 schools and programs. I work with leaders to support them and um, you know, really trying to help them to have what they need to serve students. Whew, that's a lot of schools. What is your favorite food? I'm going with a good cheeseburger. Yum. The beach or mountains? Beach all day. What do you enjoy doing in your free time? I enjoy spending time with my family, my husband, my son Seth, who's 16, and my daughter Sophia, who's 14. That's so lovely. What does being a leader mean to you? Being a leader is about dreaming big for our students. It's about um, removing barriers for people, challenging the status quo to really get our best results for students. What trend do you wish would come back? I think I'm old enough that a lot of trends already have come back, um, but there's nothing better than an 80s yearbook. I'm going big hair. <laughs> That's amazing. Growing up, what did you want to be? A kindergarten teacher. Favorite color? All shades of blue. What is your favorite song or what hits in the car? I love all music, so I don't have a favorite, but it depends on who's in the car. Could be listening to classical, country, pop, you name it. I'm with you on that. You began your career as a special education teacher. What sparked your interest? I started out of, uh, getting an elementary education degree, and when I student taught in a fourth grade classroom, I realized pretty quickly that there were students who needed something different from me, something special, and I went straight into my master's program to get a degree in special education. That's amazing. What do you love about Frederick County? I love the people. You can travel anywhere in the world. Where would it be? Anywhere with crystal blue waters, somewhere in the Caribbean. What fulfills you about your job? I think just helping people. I think um, the small wins, helping a family, helping a student, helping a teacher, a classroom, a school. I understand that you're a runner. What do you enjoy about running? Running is my me time. It is a great time for me to think and problem solve. Me times are very important. Yeah. Does any particular run stand out? Yeah, I've run a couple marathons and some half marathons. When I was 40, I ran the Freedom Half Marathon at a pretty quick clip. Um, it was hard and hilly, but when I was finished, I, it felt really good. That's incredible. Your Twitter bio says your most important job is mom. What do you love about being a mom? Well, as a mom, I do have the uh, two coolest kids on the planet. I know every mom says that. <laughs> um, but I do just love watching them grow into young adults right now. I love cheering them on on the sports fields, um, my daughter in soccer and my son in lacrosse. That's so sweet. Every child, every day. What does that mean to you? I feel like that's how I'm wired as a special educator. It's really about individual planning for students to bring out their very best and help them to reach their potential. It's about dreaming big, um, having that belief mindset, and then putting the action behind it. Chips or chocolate? Chips and salsa. Love that. How do you measure success as a leader? Success is measured really by results, and results can be measured with numbers or by experiences and perceptions. Both are really important. What advice would you give students? My advice to students is believe it and achieve it. Um, at my last school uh, where I was principal, that was our motto, you know, dream big, students. Um, figure out what that goal is that you have and work hard to accomplish it. Believe it, achieve it, because we believe in you. That advice is super amazing. I hope everyone listening is taking some notes. Thank you so much for answering these 21 questions. Thank you.